Create the miss with the pace and the depth. First serve. First serve. Steffi Graf. Steffi still leads 4-2. That's why that extra break is so valuable. Mm -hmm. You can just can't get enough of them. It's a bit of a dilemma on a windy day like this because you say, I don't want to give up my first serve, my weapon. On the other hand, I don't want to have to worry about getting a lot of second serves in. First serve. Coming up later, the five greatest points in U.S. Open history, and of course the men's semifinal, Volkoff and Sanford. Is it true that you were the one that selected those five greatest points? No. <laughs> <laughs> Can you imagine what a task that would be? I did narrate it, but I didn't pick them. Did you agree with them when you narrated them? They're pretty good. When I narrated them, I did, yeah. Oh! 30 on. Brock wants it right here. Yeah, I'm trying to keep the pressure on. in the other men's semifinal. Frenchman, Pauline. 40-30. Defeated Wally Masur. He'll play the winner of Sampras Volkov tomorrow afternoon here on CBS. He won Sampras. Game Sukovac. Game to Sukovac. He's ready to leave the party. Roughly she let you know. Five, three. <laughs> Fifteen love. The only loss she's had in 1993 in a Grand Slam event was the Australian Open final, a three-setter against Monica Sellis. Monica won her third straight Australian Open. Oh. Final score, Michigan ranked number three, lost to Notre Dame. Fifteen all. Another roll backhand from Groff, a slice to set it up, and El Cabong, 15 all. That one in 
intercepted. 30-15. This backhand had a little bit more lift to it, and Sukova was able to handle it. Trebert is 40, 30. headed down to courtside for the presentation. He might have a little weight. The championship presentation. Suva got in trouble with this one. It sat up and gave Grop plenty of time. Sukova goes to defend and isn't able to control the speed. Advantage Grop. Hurry, Tony. Heinz Goodhart and her, her good friend Renee Stubbs. Steffi Groff's third U.S. Open. Her 14th Grand Slam singles title. What a year. An emphatic win, wasn't it? Really. <laughs> From the beginning, she took charge. Steffi headed over to say... Thank you. And thank you. Now let's go down to Tim Ryan. Thank you, Pat. Congratulations are added uh, from the U.S. Open studio to the women's champion, Steffi Groff. First victory here since 1989. Her third U.S. championship. Sponsored the women's singles for the past 19 years. It's my pleasure to present you with the winner's check for $535,000. Steffi, congratulations on a, on a wonderful tournament. Uh, how do you feel you played today? Well, I thought I really played a good match. I mean, Helena had such a great tournament, and even today she played a, a strong match. But I was able to to just play a little better. <laughs> well, you won the Grand Slam in 1988. You missed it by one match this year by losing in the finals of the Australia, and then you came back and won the French Wimbledon the United States Championship. You should be very proud. Like you said, I had an incredible year, so I'm, I'm very happy about it. But um, I do know that some, there's one player who hasn't been around the last three Grand Slams, and um, that's Monica, and I just hope she'll be soon back. Nicely done. <laughs> Steffi Groff. U.S. Open, 
women's singles champion, 1993, Steffi Graf. Steffi Graf with her third Grand Slam title this year, having won the French and Wimbledon. She is now the United States Open Women's Champion. We'll return to the U.S. Open in a moment.